I remember a time when I was in school, it was a while back, a long time ago, and I was still in elementary school when I was young. Um, I wasn't paying attention. I brought some little cars that I would play with during class. Um, well, what happened was the teacher got tired of me doing it, so she took them. Well, when I was in school, then I was I'd get mad and I would just sit down there looking up like this, angry at you. And I remember one time in school, um, it was after they took it, and I refused to do anything. So what was their punishment? They stuck me in the closet. Crazy. Never told anybody. I told my mom a couple weeks ago. But other than that, it's never been put on video, or nobody else knows about it. They stuck me in a closet. I had to go to the bathroom really bad. My stomach was messed up that day. And um, I remember going out of the closet. That's funny, coming out of the closet. I remember coming out of the closet at school and telling the teacher that I had to go to the bathroom. Really bad. I was shaking. I had to go so bad. Uh, anyway, she wasn't about to let me go until I started begging. I had to plead. I had to say, please. I got to go to the bathroom. So she finally said, okay, go, but hurry up and come back. So I did. And after that, I really don't remember what happened after that. I guess I suppressed the memory or something. I don't remember. All I remember was going to the bathroom. I don't remember getting to the bathroom. That that's the story about the time they put me in the closet at school. So it was a crazy time. Of course, nowadays this is something you would hear on the news: sticking a kid in the school by uh, the closet by themselves, not um, checking on them or anything. Remember another school I went to uh, here in Indianapolis. Uh, it was an old school. When I get nervous, I chew on the side of my jaw, and I did that in class. I was still in elementary school. We moved a lot, and I was nervous. It was one of my first days. I remember sometimes I didn't like that school, so I would cry before I got on the bus. To get there, we were going in and out of shelters, and things were crazy back then. And anyway, I was going to class, and the cafeteria was always dark. The whole school was always dark. That was actually the same school when I was in the fourth grade. They put me in the first grade for a whole day. Finally, had, when I got home, showed the papers to my family. And they were like, this is for first grade. You're in fourth. I kept telling them fourth. I even showed four fingers to tell them I was in fourth. But apparently they weren't paying attention. So they put me in first grade. That's not the problem at that school. The problem was me chewing on my jaw when I was nervous, so I was going to breakfast. And the lunch lady there was very rude. I was nervous, you know. And uh, she said, spit that gum out. I said, I don't have any gum. She said, yes, you do spit it out. I said, I don't have any. I even opened my mouth and showed her. She said, stop lying, just go. I mean, rude. That was one of the worst schools I ever went to. Public school is hell. If you're going to have kids or... If you do have kids, don't send them to public school. Please. I'll tell you some more stories about school later. If you want to hear them, just... Just a quick video telling you about some of the things I went through. Thanks for watching.